Hey guys, Eagle here, back with Quantum Break. Junction 3, playing as Sophia Amaral and Martin Hatch. I assume, since the last junction I played, the last two junctions I played as Serene. Or it's about Sophia and Martin. Let's get back into it. Thing growing inside me. Yeah, he has cancer. I've been fighting it for six hard years. Dr. Amaral was developing a cure for the Cronon Syndrome. She was the only one who could administer the treatments that kept my sickness at bay. Paul? And Jack had taken her away from me. Hmm. You're... They took her. Without Sophia, there's no chance of a cure. We did all we could. But there are forces within Monarch working against you, and I believe Burke was just the tip of the iceberg. It wasn't just Joyce that did this. Sir? Uh, we've recovered Dr. Amaral's laptop. We have it set up over there if you want to take a look. I'll be right there. Interesting. <laughs> I want to go over Sophia's figures. If she's right, the fracture is escalating a lot faster than we anticipated. <laughs> you know the future. Dr. Amro doesn't. Is the lifeboat even in a viable state for activation? She's trying to convince you the schedule's wrong. Why? To get you to rush this? To make a mistake? The people oppose them. She could be one of them. She isn't. Are you willing to bet the entire plan on that? I implore you, hold off on activation, Paul. Let me clean house before this gets completely out of hand. She can't inspect that just yet. How do you want to proceed? Somebody was working against me. Somebody close. Martin Hatch. Sophia Amaral. I could only trust one of them. I'll have to shoot the Amaral and Hatch. I have some information about Martin Hatch. Martin had been my closest advisor for years. I began to wonder if that had been a mistake. Sophia's loyal. She's always been loyal. I don't think we can trust her. The way she looked at the countermeasure like she's seen it before. She knows what it does. Sophia's research had saved my life. Loyalty doesn't run any deeper. Ah. I don't think I quite agree with that. All right, Amaral. Let's go fix the time machine. I said I'd try. Evidence was mounting against Sophia. I couldn't simply ignore it, despite everything we had been through. But she knew you'd never make it without those treatments. Then she took them away. If she turned against me with what she knew, the damage could be immeasurable. I think I'm gonna have to go with Emerald, just because we know Emerald. Based on the story, Emerald is not a traitor. So, do that. Sophia's data has always been good. I'll trust her judgment. We need to analyze these figures and make final preparations to activate the lifeboat protocol at once. Fine. I'll take the laptop to the science department. No, I think I'll do that myself. See. Sir? Put people on Mr. Hatch. I want constant eyes on them. Yes, sir. You got it. 
We pulled some images from the security cameras. We've identified Joyce's accomplice. She's Beth Wilder, one of our mid-level operatives. Her. My God, she's been with us all along. She's working with Jack. Where is she now? Unknown. But we've got a kill team tracking her. No, 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 no. She can't be killed. Not yet. Find her. And whatever Mr. Hatch does, I want to know about it. Don't screw this up. Game made by Microsoft. Beth Wilder. I guess it only makes it sense to have name. a surface in it. But she had been there in the past. When it all started. Movie time. Community. Movie time. They're losing their effectiveness. There's no changing the inevitable. Time is just one closed loop. The flashback. I bet we're gonna run into Dr. Kim at some point. It even looks like it hurts. I hate doing eye drops, it's the worst. What did Burke want with you? Well, I don't know. I don't even know what the lifeboat protocol is. It's a sanctuary. Designed to shelter a list of monarchs essential personnel to weather the storm until they can develop a solution. Essential personnel? So that means that I'd be on that list, right? Not under Paul Sawin's lead, you wouldn't. He's failed to see the value of his own people. <laughs> Too consumed with grand ideals and delusions. You know what I find to be the most terrifying notion on this planet? The idea of God. Simply the idea. A being with that much power. The ability to take and give so freely, that kind of control. But should be feared, not worshipped. Yet, people believe in it. Just as people believe in Paul Sawin. <laughs> 
<laughs> See, what's so scary about God isn't his control, but rather if he ever lost it. Paul's serene has become unhinged, Sean. He's triggered a catastrophe. He has the chance to fix it, but he's choosing not to. He's choosing to let things end. End of time. And this is where we come in. We risk too much leaving the keys to the kingdom in one man's hands. We need insurance. There's something called the CFR. It's a crucial key to our survival and must remain safe. But as long as Paul is the only one with access to it, it isn't. With access to the CFR, I will take over. Get Monarch back on track, and once I do, restructuring will be in order, Charlie. Restructuring that will see you as my right hand. That seems a little weird. I'll be on the list. Absolutely. In a sort of privileged isolation, it can only be done from the inside. Huh. That's me. I put the island on lockdown. But the pump house on the west side has an old supply tunnel that runs beneath the bay. No one knows about it. You'll go and see. Do we get to play this 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 I'm guy? Essence, Charlie. You better get to it. Yeah. Commander Davis. Yes, sir. Head to the perimeter lab. We're moving forward. 17 hours after fracture. The frequency of the studs is still unpredictable, but they're persistent. Erratic, but persistent. I need certainty. I initiate the protocol. There's no going back. Mr. Serene, something like this. There is no certainty. We've never dealt with it before. How long? We've been running Dr. Amaral's simulations. It's hard to say without her to confirm, but... Just give me a time. The Joyce Phil could collapse within eight hours. <laughs> Mr. Serene, if you're going to proceed, now would be the time to decide. Just left the surface there. Wait, then if there's a stutter in the area, why is there no stutter on the island? Unless this is just a different time. Weird. He's he's dead. He's gonna die. Charlie. You all right? You fine? You going? You're right. Time's ending, just like you said. And the lifeboat protocol. It's a place. They built it to protect people from the fracture. And the only problem is, is that if there's a list and anyone who's not on it is pretty much fucked. But if we make it back to the mainland, huh. I, I can get us on the list. All of this entire island is on lockdown. How are we going to do that, Charlie? There's a tunnel. Hey, all right, if you are lying to me this time, I swear to God. Get off! Tired as shit. I don't know why you're doing this, but I don't have to put your name on shit, motherfucker. <laughs> nice. I'm gonna tell you why you're gonna put me on that list. I got a pregnant wife at home, and she is the only thing that I am thinking about right now. So if you get in the way of me protecting her, I swear to fucking God, next time, you will not catch your breath. Lead the way. 
<laughs> well, if he's on the list, his wife will certainly be on the list. 17 hours after fracture. Fingerprint. What is that? Not sure. <laughs> it's the audiobook. <laughs> That's hilarious. It's, yeah, bar. Imprisonment. It's unsettling. This cannot end well. It's time for you to rejoin the others. To return to the infinite. This won't end well. It can't end well. Apologies if there's any stutters in my recording, just because I know it's a lot for my software to record. That can't be good either. Liam? Run, you! Jeez. Don't quit running. You do okay? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I'm good. We need to get... 
Just killed the guy. Jesus. What? You can't hotwire that car. It's push start ignition. Almost guaranteed. The mirrors, huh? I'll see you there. Fuck. Fuck. I knew someone was going to get killed. Good job. Nice. That was violent. Get shot in the shoulder. Definitely wouldn't have killed him. I knew he was going to do that. Wow. Come on, one more. <laughs> 18 hours after. Davis and his team. They were all good men. Monarch's finest. about my treatments I'm afraid so you know what this means if you don't know for sure I've been standing here you let this happen <laughs> Jack he wants me to be happy he wants me to suffer until the end Joyce and Wiley but what was troubling me is who got them in the king's lab. She paid a visit while she was thought to be missing. Minutes before the explosion. Ooh, blackmail. Paul. Paul, will you... Paul, will you listen to me? Look, it's time you see her for who she really is. This was a party gift. They forced her. She's trying to destroy you, She's Paul. trying to help me. Oh, Jesus. Look at you. The smartest man I know. Blinded by a fool's love. Deception everywhere. Sophia's loyal. She's gotten inside your head. She's always been loyal. 
You need to think about this. If the fracture's happening now, I owe this to you. Hmm. Wow, they're turning it on. Really eager to see what this thing does. God, now. Dr. Holden? What the hell is it? The protocol's been initiated. I need to wake my family. I'm afraid we have no time. Wow, all right. That sucks. Hey, pal. I'm glad you could make it. I was just telling your girl here how concerned about you we've been. Emily, we need to go. Go? What's the rush? Shoot him now. Just kill him now. Aha! Ah! Is that teeth I heard at the table? Just kill him now. She's not going anywhere. I'm gonna give me the keys. Give me the keys. Get away from me. Get away from me. Listen, 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 please, please, please. This is not who I am. This is not me. I'm telling you, I never felt good doing this. I, I never, I never felt good doing this. But it's the only thing I knew how to do. And when I got back, I couldn't, I couldn't find anything. I couldn't find anything to do. And Monarch, they found that useful. And they put me to work. Oh, he's a vet. I couldn't stand, I couldn't stand being alone. 
So every Tuesdays and Wednesdays, I would, I would walk down the street because it was the only two nights that the bartender, and she wasn't in school. And I told myself every night that I was keeping her. It took me a fucking year. And like, if mom, I, if they gave me structure, you gave me purpose. I did this to protect you. I did this to protect us, our family. I did this to protect our family. And I'm waking up for this to me. Something terrible is coming, and I will explain to you on the way, but we have to move. We have to move right now. If you would just let me, if you would just let me protect you on my side. Interesting. I'm gonna end it after this episode as I've been doing. Oh boy. some information about Martin Hatch. Wah, 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 wah. I want him apprehended. Immediately. Thank you all for watching. Hope you have enjoyed. This was Junction 3 and Episode 3. <sighs> I'm going to keep the train moving. Have a great day, everybody.